Hey guys, what's going on? It's Alex and Mr. Miles by here, and today I'm going to be showing you how I record my Minecraft videos. Uh, I've had a few requests, a few private messages um, on people asking me how I record my Minecraft. Obviously, the quality is uh, really nice, otherwise, people wouldn't be asking me, would they? Um, so, yeah, I'm going to go ahead today and show you how I do it, the steps that I take. Uh, you may not have the programs that I have, but I will uh, put the programs in the, in the description. Um, they do cost the programs, a few of them quite expensive, but they, they get the job done and. Um, you, I think you do get a 30 day free trial on the Sony Vegas so um, yeah uh, without further ado let's get into this and uh, just a quick note before we start guys if the video does help you out please can I give it a like rating and I hope you've noticed if you watched my videos before that my mic quality is better um, I have altered a few settings and I'm hoping that you know it's better you know um, just please comment and tell me if it is uh, so yeah without further ado let's get straight into this Right, so what I record my Minecraft with is Fraps, a uh, piece of software called Fraps. Uh, there, as you can see on my desktop, it's just a lightweight uh, recording software which you know can record. I'll drag it in right now. Here it is. Um, so when you open it up, when you open it up, you get the uh, you get the general tab. Now it'll obviously say what your email address is and crap like that. Um, and you obviously have to buy it. I think you will get a free trial with it. I'm not sure, but it's only thirty pounds, I think, if you want to buy it, or about forty dollars. So if you want to go ahead and fork out the money on that, then you can do. Right, this is the general tab. I'll show you the settings that you need to use. Uh, start fraps minimized. Have that unticked. That's just confusing. Um, fraps window always on top. Yes, you want that ticked. And monitor error desktop W M the W uh, D M W W no D W M. Sorry, I can't even get it right. Um, this basically allows me to record my desktop. Uh, usually, what this would do is uh, default to recording a game if you had the game open. Um, let's say for instance Minecraft uh, but this if I've got this ticked it will actually monitor the desktop and record the desktop so that's why I've got this ticked um, if you're going to record a new game you don't want this ticked this is just for the purposes of this video uh, if you go along to the FPS tab you just want to make sure you've got all the settings um, all the settings the same as me I don't actually know what this tab does um, the only thing I'd ever use on this tab is you can see this little um, this little you know red thing in the corner this is the frames per second what it's recording at um, I'm recording at you know pretty good frames per second. It's not lagging at all. Um, it would be higher if I'm recording Minecraft. Um, don't think my computer's bad or anything. It's just because when you're recording uh, Windows, it t tends to lag a bit. Hopefully the video will be fine though, and that we in a really good quality. Uh, but this here, the corner overlay, this basically tells you where this is. So if I put it here, it goes in the bottom corner down there, here, or I can just hide it. Uh, for the purposes of this video, I'll just leave it in the top corner. Uh, movies tab. Make oh, actually make sure you've got everything the same as on here. Movies tab. This is where you want to pay attention. This is where the file destination will, you know, save. Um, I've got mine in a folder called Fraps, and it's on my desktop on on my uh, other screen, which is over here. Um, so that's just where it's going to record the files. Uh, your number five. You can click here, click in this box actually, and press another button on your keyboard, and this will actually uh, this will be your key to stop and start recording. There's no pause or anything, guys. It's just a lightweight piece of software that records HD video. Uh, so you've just got stop and uh, start recording and mine's uh, the uh, numlock 5 key so uh, that's what I've got mine as. <coughs> uh, frames per second, you don't want 29.97, go away. Uh, you want 30 frames per second, that's what seems to work best for me so it should be work be should work best for you as well. And uh, here you want to record the Windows 7 sound or whatever operating system you have, uh, this will just record you know, like this game sound or whatever. Keep this on stereo, don't have it on multi-channel because that like messes it up and you'll have um, like your voice coming out the left channel and it'll just be a really annoying so just keep this on stereo and record external input you want to have this on this should you know record whatever back from microphone or the back mic or the astro mix amp that you've got to record your microphone um, I've got that ticked to record my invoice um, and commentaries leave all these unticked or you can that's pretty self-explanatory you can tick these if you want but leave this one unticked don't tick that otherwise it will lag loads um, you can tick these ones if you want to but don't tick the bottom one leave that unticks unticks, unticked, and uh, leave screenshots <coughs> that's just self-explanatory, that's if you want to take a screenshot of the screen you can you can work that out for yourself right so that's fraps over and done with, now we can move on to Sydney Vegas, let me drag this in here we go, this is Sydney Vegas, this is what I use to uh, edit and compose my videos if you like um, I'm gonna go ahead and drag this test clip in which is on my desktop at the moment, this is a uh, Minecraft clip that I just made um, here you go. As you can see, it's a 19 second clip and it's 620 meg. Um, if you go back to Fraps and uh, click on the Movies tab, you can see that I'm in full size here. This records in full 1080p. Uh, half size records in 480, which is fine for Minecraft, but if you want it, you know, if you want the proper stuff, then you're going to go for full size. This records in full 1080. But as you can see, the file sizes are huge, um, absolutely massive. So that might be something to bear in mind um, if you're uh, if you've got a small hard drive. 
Right, so I'm going to show you what to do in Sony Vegas. What you're going to need to do here is don't click on the audio, click on the video, right click, properties, click disable resample and maintain aspect ratio. Basically what these two do is make it fit the screen, you can see it has two black um, bars here. Maintain aspect ratio makes it you know, 720 or 1080p or whatever, whatever render settings you've got, which we're going to go over um, in about 20 minutes. 20 minutes about in about 20 seconds rather and disable resample that basically makes it so it doesn't lag so if you paused it on a frame and it wouldn't like merge frames uh, just make sure you've got that like that and that unticked and then you should be good to go um, now once you've done that and you've got your clips together click on this arrow here make sure you've got all the same settings in the drop down list there it is HDV 720-30 and all these settings are absolutely the same um, 29.97 frame rate bit rate 8 uh, rendering quality best and make sure you have start all new projects with these settings click apply and ok this will basically mean you won't have to go into there again it will always you know save those settings so we've got our clip ready here it's all you know ready to get rendered out we're going to upload this this is our commentary let's just say uh, so you're going to go ahead and click file click render as um, and now I'm going to just show you what you need to do. So um, you might have Vegas 9 or Vegas 10 or you may you might be downloading right now Vegas 11 which is what I've got um, it's basically exactly the same. You're going to want to click Render As and go down and click Windows Media V11. Click the drop down list so you get the um, the formula that are inside here. And then you want to go to any of these ones, 4.85 or 6. Click Customize Template. And then make sure that you've got CBR, Windows Media V9 Video, High Definition 1280 by 720. Your audio is all that, obviously, just leave that as it is. Uh, pixel aspect ratio 1 square, um, frame rate 29.970, key uh, frame per second 5, uh, that ticked, put that on 3, make sure this is 100, if you're running in Vegas 9 or 10 you want this on 90, but if you're in Vegas 11 you want this on 100, that gives you better quality. Um, internet LAN ticked on the bitrate tab, you want to put this as 3.50. Um, index summary, leave that unticked and don't put anything in here. Project, you want put this as best and leave that as project settings then you can name this minecraft or whatever you want to call it or youtube hd whatever you want to call it and then go ahead and click the save tab i won't do this because i've already got one saved as you can see it's right here um, and then you go ahead and click render but for, before, before you do that you're going to want to browse and put it somewhere you know where you want to and call the file just like test or call it test for this video click render and then there you go it's rendering out the video which is um quite nice and then you can go ahead and upload that it'll put the file on your desktop so guys i hope this video has explained you know how to get good quality and everything and you know if it has ex if it has worked for you you go ahead and like the video and please comment if you do have any problems and i'm always on youtube so you can message me if you want to um so i hope you enjoyed the video